Hello ladies and gents, it's the final episode of How's the Solihull Property Market Dom in 2023. 2023 has been a blast. Thank you to all of those that have supported the business and engaged across our social media platforms throughout the year. I never expected these weekly updates to attract the following that they have, having had over 200,000 views this year across our social platforms. I've gone round and round in circles today because there's just so much information that I'd love to deliver. Um, but what I'm going to do is give you a short, sharp overview of that activity in the postcodes that we cover, those being B90 to B95. There's been 4,702 properties become available over the last 12 months, with 3,745 of those new to market in the last 12 months. 2,353 have had sales agreed and 1,704 have had their prices reduced. The shocking reality of this year's market is that only 50% of what came to market has ended up having a sale agreed and that one in three properties that have come to market have had to have, have their prices reduced. I've harped on all year about getting your marketing strategy right and in a turbulent year, whilst that is not easy, I'm delighted that here at the m Co we've exceeded the local average and have agreed sales on 70% of what we have taken to market. This year there has been no shortage of buyers. As a business we've registered 3,342 new buyers, carried out over 4,500 viewings and that has resulted in agreeing 342 sales. The rental market has been incredibly active with Gabrielle and her team meeting 2,874 new tenants and managing 216 move-ins. I expect that 2024 will start positively with mortgage rates now available at sub 4%. What is gonna happen with the base rate? If I'm a betting man, I'd say that it's gonna end 2024 lower than it is today, but how much lower is the question? Don't forget it's an election year and that government will want to keep the housing market moving and that pressure may well lead to incentives being delivered in the spring budget. That's scheduled for the 6th of March. Memorable moments for me this year, I've got three that I'm going to share with you. The first is being recognised in the Best Estate Agents Guide. This puts us in the top 2% of independent estate agents across the UK. This is the only independently audited award in the UK and testament to the 30 teams' strong hard work and devotion to delivering exceptional customer service across the market. The second is the sale of my childhood neighbour's house, Lots of fond memories there, kicking and losing balls over fences. Um, that property remained in the family for the next 30 years and it was an honour to get that property sold this year. The final one is delivering the most expensive house sale in the area, exchanging at just short of £8 million a couple of weeks ago. Sets a new record locally and demand for that type of property, ladies and gents, is out there. I've got a handful of buyers um, that are looking to spend up to 10 million pounds, one 12 million pounds. They're prepared to buy it four, five or six million, knock the house down and spend a similar amount to, to deliver their dream home. The future here at DM & Co is as bright as ever. We finished the year positively. That has led to cementing ourselves as the number one selling agent in the B91 postcodes and the number one selling agent in the million pound plus market. We've grown our market share from the Dorridge office and look forward to both selling and renting more properties in B93 in 2024. We've ended the year with a stronger sales and lettings team that is excited by what the next 12 months bring. Thank you once again for all of your support in 2023. And if there is anything property related that we can help you with, you know where to find us in 2024. Take care, enjoy uh, what is now the end of the year and I wish you all a healthy, happy and prosperous 2024.